Hey guys, I'm Megan O'Leavy here at our LA stop of the UFC World Press Tour. We've got hundreds of fans lined up waiting to be let in. Four UFC champions and their challengers will be taking questions from everyone here in Los Angeles. Let's take a look at some behind the scenes action. Bonjour, Saint Pierre. Bonjour, comment ça va? Vous parlez français? Uh, comme ça. Yeah, there we go. We speak français. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, this is Ronda Rousey, and this is backstage the UFC World Tour. It's a unisex dressing room, if you haven't noticed, because the very fantastic Gain Velasquez is sitting on this couch purely for my entertainment. He's not here to do anything, really. Did you get my memo about the white pants? Thank you for wearing yours. Yes, yours. yes. I, uh, I saw the tweet, uh, your tweet video this, this morning, and uh, I thought I'd try to coordinate with you. So. Twinsies. That's right. Oh, yes. Thanks, John. <laughs> What's up, Los Angeles? How are you today? I want to thank all the fans and all the media for coming out today in what is the baddest close of a year that we've ever had. The fights that are lined up the rest of this year are insane, and just some of them are up here on the podium today. I have this philosophy that everybody wants to watch a great fight, man. If there's a great fight on, everybody wants to watch it. You just got to know it's on and when it's on. And we're trying to get out in front of this. We, are, we have such a stellar end of the year that we want to get out in front of this thing, let people know that they're happening, and then we'll start focusing on each fight one at a time. John, you've got a busy schedule this week. We're here on the UFC World Media Tour. What do you think of it so far? Dude, I'm really excited about this tour. Um, I've never done anything like it before, traveling to different countries to promote a fight. I think it's going to be huge for this fight, huge for the fans in Sweden, and, uh, you know, just huge for everyone. So I'm excited to be a part of it for sure. And Los Angeles might be a special stop for you. We're pretty close to home. There's a large Hispanic population here. Are you excited to see everyone fill this Nokia theater? Being here yesterday in San Francisco, Seems like a lot of fans come out for these, um, you know, when, when it's in this area, so it's, it's good. There's tons of fans lined up outside right now. How cool is it for you to be able to go across the country and meet these people who are supporting Johnny Hendricks? Uh, it's pretty amazing. It's about putting on good shows for them and, uh, you know, meeting and greeting them, uh, keeping them happy. How's it going with Misha? You just spent all these weeks with her for the Ultimate Fighter, and now you've got to go essentially around the country with her. Yeah, well, hopefully we don't have to like sit next to each other on the plane. She tends to not talk to me or look look me in the eye at all when we pass, so she doesn't bring anything up to my face because she never has the balls to. So it's just usually me talking. She mostly just doesn't look me in the eye or talk to me a lot of the time, which uh, I like to relate to Mike Tyson's speech about uh, seeing the chink in the armor when your opponent won't look you in the eye, and that's pretty much how it goes all the time. That's not what happened backstage. Uh oh. -uh. We're going to be best friends by the time this is over. <laughs> that or we're going to end up killing each other, one of the two. You know, tensions run high, but, you know, we'll, we'll both be able to punch each other in December, so we'll just have to look <laughs> forward to that moment. <laughs> and you're also staying connected with your opponent, George St. Pierre. You guys are in all these different cities together. Is that kind of weird? We've talked, you know, so that, which is nice. You guys might share friendship bracelets or something after the fight. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to get, you know, a half heart, and he's going to get the other half. Best and friend. Yes, yes, yes there you go. <laughs> The crowd was fantastic here. The people in LA are awesome, man. <laughs> oh, man. You guys like to boo me. I realize it. it was fun. Hope you enjoyed all the behind the scenes access here in Los Angeles. This belt is going to our next stop. We'll see you tomorrow in New York City.